uh, how can a young sportscaster accelerate their development? Write as much as you can. Absolutely write as much as you can. Um, I would do, I, I, would, I would try to listen and watch as much as I can on television or radio, depending upon which genre you, you want to get into. Frankly, I think you, you probably need to think about getting into both because it is all about versatility, as I said already. But um, I, I would definitely write because you have to learn how to have your voice and what it is that you're saying. You have to learn how to make it heard. You want people to understand who you are and you know, by the tone and the tenor of how you write. Uh, but I would also listen and watch as much as I can and listen to the announcers. You don't develop your style from thin air. You develop your style by listening to your favorite announcers. Um, I listened to Jack Buck quite a bit when I was little, when I was younger. Uh, Vern Lundquist was another. Frank Gleber was another in the Dallas area. He was one of the original voices of the Dallas Cowboys. Uh, and, and, you know, you try to pick up some of their mannerisms without picking up their, their catchphrases, you know, because catchphrases have to come naturally. If, if, they, if they're... Uh, you know, if you throw them out there, sometimes they sound real trite and they sound worn and done. If it comes naturally, it's fine. Uh, but I, I wouldn't try to come up with a catchphrase because it can sound goofy and take away from your credibility. Um, but what I would try to emulate is people that I respect in the industry. And then after you repeat time and time again and go over and over again, you develop your own routine, your old, your, your own um, um, uh, attitudes. Uh, and your own, um, uh, I guess the, the best way to put it is you, you, you develop your own sing-song, really. And what comes out of your mouth is yours. And that's how you develop you. So um, I would pay a lot of attention to do some critical listening to those that you really admire in the business.